What up everybody, this is DGK, this is going to be Infinite Magic Raid again. Today I want to talk to you guys about the importance of uh, going to be leveling up uh, heroes and which ones you're going to want to kind of target first and why. So heroes in this game are going to be the hardest thing you're going to come across to try to get. Um, you're going to have a lot of epics, these purple ones here that you see me putting in. So if you see these, uh, we don't have any in there. No, go up here, see if we can get one out of this. Uh, nope, still no. Okay. Nope. Hmm, haven't needed any yet. Yeah, we'll get one here. Still like this here. You're going to get a lot of these, so it's going to be important that you decide how you want to build your team and who you want to build it around and why it's important to watch who you're leveling up and not just level up anybody right away. So if you are just getting into this game, just finding this game, probably the easiest one that's going to help you the most in Arena and everywhere else for your heroes is going to be this little epic here. If you don't have any legendaries yet, his name is Holder. He is super strong base stats. Uh, he inflicts bleed, puts layers of bleed up, which is awesome. But here's what he does that really can kill you. Uh, his counterattack and his attack up increased by 20%. Meanwhile, grants himself counterattack. After he grants that counterattack, he gains one more action round. But he's very easy to level up. So I technically, I could make him a 5-star now and level him up. But I've had enough uh, legendaries currently that I haven't done so yet. I may later on. But he's the easiest one that you get first. But in order to level up one of your heroes... What you're going to need to do, so for, let's say we want to level up this one. We either got to feed them these eggs here, which I don't really want to do right now. I'm saving those. Or five non, you really want to feed the blues. You don't want to do anything less than the blue. Once you're feeding these epics here, you're losing out on your own. You're losing out on yourself. So you're going to want to level up these blues. But the problem with getting the blues, uh, you have to get them through wishes. <clears throat> Actually, you can get other ones through... Oh, I didn't make it there yet, huh? You can get uh, heroes through just doing stages. You get one and two star heroes, and that's basically what you're going to need to craft anything. So if you cruise on down here, these are what to level this guy up. I don't have sufficient materials, but you're need, each one of these that you want to make a five star, you need to sacrifice five five stars to or an egg. So if we wanted to go ahead and level the guy up, I was just talking about, where is he at here? Right here. Then we could go ahead and feed him these five. He would become, he'd be able to go to level 100. <clears throat> now, the reason why you don't want to be uh, using your epics as food, because you, when you go into here into heroes, once you awaken any one of these heroes to level 110, I believe it is, yep. You can then get their exclusive weapon by adding another hero of the same kind. Okay, so you have to have two of them to get this exclusive weapon and get all these leveled up here. So for me, so I want to level up. This is one of my uh, supports here. She's also a healer. So I believe I have another one of her down here. So if I level her up to level 110, I can get her exclusive weapon on here which will raise these extra stats. So if I'm just eating random <coughs> um, epic heroes, I'm not going to be able to get that exclusive weapon because I'm going to have to keep drawing out of this wish here to try. Let's see if I have enough to even do one. I don't yet. Uh, I'm going to have to keep drawing out of the wish in order to get that exclusive weapon on them. So the exclusive weapons right now, I'm not going to be able to get these on any of my legendaries that I have here currently unless I get another one. So once I get another one, then I can feed it into them. So basically that's what you're going to do with the dupes here. But if I go ahead and I decide he's real good and I eat another one of him or I have two or three, I won't be able to uh, get the exclusive weapon leveled up for him. So we're going to have we're going to want to go ahead and watch what we're eating. I will eat some, uh, some epics here, but they're just ones I know that I'm not going to use. Um, so basically... I'm going to show you what else you're going to want to look at. So, okay, how are you going to know if you want to eat them or not? Well, you have this thing here called the Tower of Mark. I have all five keys. But to go through the red Tower of Mark, I'm going to need to have five red heroes leveled up to get through this, um, which is going to give me 
things that I need to upgrade my champions when I go in here and I want to change like their uh, their abilities. When I go into hero, I can go in here and then I can go to like the emblem here. It's gonna give me what I need for these to level these up. No, it's not. Sorry, it's going to be up. Ooh, where is it here? Talents. Okay, so if I want to level up my red ones, I'm gonna need these to upgrade this right here. So you don't want you don't want to get to getting rid of all your heroes of faction or uh, a color here because if I don't have any greens or yellows or I don't have enough, I'm not going to be able to get through those stages like I need to. And this game is huge on actual counterattack and actual battle systems. So I should be able to show you in here. Get a refresh. Maybe I can get somebody that I can actually like to... Uh, we'll give this one a shot. Okay, so here's your color chart which you're going to want to go through so your yellows here are going to be strong no mark can counter the force marks and vice versa but here you're going to have red to blue blue to green green to red so if you hit if my blue he doesn't have any uh if my red if i had a red and it hits i do and it hits his greens they're going to counter attack automatically so let's just watch how this goes see if we can unfold this so I can show you a little better. But either way, what you're gonna to wanna to do with these champs or these heroes, uh, you're not gonna to wanna to give up anything that you may want an exclusive weapon for, and you're not just gonna to wanna to feed any kind of epics to food. So the hardest thing in this game is not gonna be gear, it's not gonna be a lot of things. It's going to be getting more of these champions to level up the ones that you have. So just watch a quick little battle here. See, we took out a green with a green. Let's see if my red, oh, so you're gonna see a counter attack maybe yep see how he countered that oh, he's really getting me here oh yeah he's gonna get me good ouch yeah I got no chance here well maybe if I could take this out those two are not Ugh, nope I can't oh I haven't won it arena battle a little bit here so either way uh, be careful of what you're going to put in for uh, food for these. So currently, I'm on a quest where I need to make a level three, a three star here. So I'm gonna need four different three stars or, or four different five stars to make this a uh, level 130. Right now I got one. So I'm gonna need to make four more. So either way, just pay attention to how you wanna build your team. I, I actually built him. He's very good, but I don't think he needed to be over level 100. So just pay attention to what you're sacrificing down here in this craft screen. If anything, and you just want a guide, just quick craft. I don't have anything to do right now. It's only gonna do things that aren't epics. Uh, so like right now I could choose to make this a five star by feeding it one, two, three, four. Yeah, I could give it another one. I don't want to though. I'll wait till I make one. Um, and just make sure that you're paying attention to what you're feeding these guys. We might have enough now. No, still nothing, huh? Interesting. Okay. So either way, that's how you're gonna want to look at your heroes and leveling up your heroes, and uh, just have a lot of fun with this game. It is super fun. I haven't been able to stop playing it. You guys are gonna love it too. But if you liked the video, hit the subscribe and the like button, and thank you for watching, man. Enjoy the games.